I've been working with the homeless now for about 30 years here. The families that we work with at the uh, Willie Sanchez Rosales Family Center are those that are intact families or families with the mother and the father or with uh, a son that is uh, older than is allowed in most uh, women's shelters. It had always been a dream for my mother to open up a shelter for um, the homeless. Initially the idea was homeless men. Probably in his late 20s is when I think we realized that my brother um, suffered from bipolar disorder and manic depression. In addition to that, he also struggled with alcohol addiction. There were months where, you know, we weren't in contact with him. We didn't know where he was, but we, you know, people would run into him. They'd say they'd seen him out on the streets. My brother passed away at the age of 44 as a result of a suicide. So a couple years before my mother passed away, my father had actually seen this building for sale um, and immediately came out and looked at the building. My parents, you know, both being older, really felt like, you know, we were not in a position to actually start a shelter, but why don't we look at what resources currently exist and see if we can partner up with one of them. My mom was really taken with Ray Tullius and his personal story, um, knowing that Ray himself and his wife had been homeless at some point, knowing that Ray um, had overcome, um, you know, an, an addiction of his own, really touched my mother's heart. And um, she came back that day after meeting with a couple different agencies and said, you know, I, I, I would like to um, work with the Opportunity Center. <laughs> But it has helped, I would say, uh, you know, at least 100, 150 families since we've opened five or six years ago. Uh, and so it has, you know, for those families, it has made a huge difference, you know. And so it's, it's helped put a lot of them back in together and back into employment and housing and have kept the families together. When my mom passed away, without us even asking or putting it out there, we were getting several donations in her name and I wanted to go to the Willie Sanchez Rosales Family Center. So a fund like this through the Paso Norte Foundation enables us to um, you know, have a place where people can continue to, con to donate. But we really hope that you know, through this and having the fund established, um, and just the opportunity to see the facility that it'll touch people's hearts and they'll continue to, to give um, so that we can build this up.